I will be your shield. Aspirants gather to test their precision in the air. Think you can keep up? So when you start the challenge, you have access to two buttons. The first one allows you to flap. The second one only becomes active once you've bounced ten times. So at first I just want to get a feel for the track, so I didn't even try and soar at first. It's also possible to do this without soaring if you want to do it that way, but that also means that there's a slightly higher chance for you to fail because you have to flap a few more times. I also looked at the spears on the bottom as sets of three. So if you drew an invisible line between the tip of the first spear to the tip of the third, that is like your hitbox. So don't think that you can fall between the first and the second or the second and the third, because you will fail. So once I had a feel for the best place to jump, which I found it was between 11 and 11 and a half jumps, depending on how close I was to the arch. You can see on that one I just hit the last one, so I had to save myself a little bit early, which I didn't do on that attempt. This time I will have a cleaner jump. So once you have the first leap down, it's all about shorter, quicker jumps for the second half because the corridor is a little bit narrower. And then here we go again. So one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There we go, like eleven and a half. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and then on the fourteenth. Actually, look like I failed when I hit that last spear. Thankfully, the achievement propped. So, as usual, thanks for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.